I'm sure most of the developers and adopters would be more interested in this part. So this is the practical part where we will create our first own data service. So in part one, we talked about the terminologies and the definitions. Here we'll see in reality how those terminologies are translated into actual product project. So this is the um, brief outline what we'll do today. So we'll create a project in transaction ACGW. Then we will define the data models where we'll define our entity type and the entity set. We'll re regenerate the runtime artifacts. So, so when you regenerate artifacts, the data provider classes and the model provider classes will get created. So it will have standard um, functions and methods. So then we need to redefine those methods uh, to write a custom logic in those methods. So we'll we'll write in the get entity and get entity set methods, and we'll also do some post operations which says create entity and create entity set. So it will create some uh, entries in the tables in, in database in SAP, and then finally we'll register and activate the OData service. So you can use that OData service and test it. Uh, so let's go to SAP now.